All right, so Ori has just tagged. So tag is a game that Rick Hunter has brought over to our server. You can check out his videos and it explains um, more about tag there. So basically, I have to do the forfeit that's in the book and I can't tag anyone else for four hours. So my forfeit is that I have to ride a strider and I have to greet people a certain way. A bit later on in the, um, in the footage, I'll show you the book. Um, I have sped this up a bit, so I just did a quick video on getting the strider ready for me to ride it till I tag somebody. Um, the strider is incredibly slow unless you're like fishing with the hook. Um, the more that you use the fishing rod and like your fishing motion, the quicker you wear it out and I haven't put on breaking or mending on it at all. So I've just name tagged my rider, caught him and got him ready. Um, and most of the footage has been sped up, but the footage at the beginning of my tunnel when I first hop on the strider shows you exactly how painfully slow it is just on regular speed. This is Strider on regular speed if I'm not using the fishing like fishing rod and casting for it. So it's incredibly slow. <laughs> and I was really glad that I got rid of it so quick. My aim of the game was the next morning, the first person I saw, I was tagging. The next part of the video will basically just be a tour of what I've been doing in the last couple of weeks. Um, we have had some really, really bad lag problems on the server, so a lot of the footage just 
is just horrible um, and the building footage and it was just yeah can't really work with it so basically what happened was our server provider that we were using for Seacraft closed down so we had to find a new one so after looking around and getting lots of suggestions and um, we were referred to a certain service provider which we signed up for for three months um, we were having lag problems and we worked really hard with the service provider we were in you know their chat group asking questions we did everything they suggested but the lag just wasn't improving they were putting it down to 1.18 and yeah like 1.18 has contributed a lot to to lag issues and there's a lot of bugs but this was just more than usual um, so our contract with that service provider was coming to an end in February um, so a few days ago I just decided that I would just give another service provider another server host a, um, a go and see if that would fix it so we swapped over to another server just transferred the whole files they were so accommodating and we haven't had any lag issues since swapping so that's really great news because it's been so hard for all the players and like we've got such a great group of players that and everyone gets on pretty well you know people have stuck it out just because of the community and because of the people that are here we've got really awesome people so um that is great news especially for the um, content creators um that yeah it's just going to make life on the server a whole heap better and that our videos will be yeah we'll have more footage and i'll be able to do some more builds and time lapses and now we'll be able to uh, put on um, Foxy's um, it's a bit like yeah it's just like another camera mod that we did try early on but the lag was so bad that we took it off so moving forward we now are with a new server host and everything is running smoothly so we should have more videos um, coming out and more content coming out so we've got a few things we want to do one of the um, guys on the server has organized like a mining competition thing so we've got a few of us have bought the kits now that the lag is better and there's no more block lag we'll be able to do that so there'll be lots and lots of new things coming yeah now that the lag is pretty much sorted so um yeah i just want to thank everyone who has stuck by us watched our videos even though they, they just haven't been the same as what they usually are and those who did stay with us on the server and put up with <laughs> all the lag and the headaches and it was a, yeah it was an absolute nightmare but i just really want to thank the players for being patient while we tried to work out the best solution and try to fix it and I think we gave our other server host more than enough chances and you know we worked really we worked hard with them but uh, yeah I don't know what the issue was like we were on their top package so it shouldn't have been the issue that it was but we're moving forwards now we've got a new provider and it's full steam ahead from Shadowlands. On to the tour.